Women have the power to transform this world. We can end crime and violence if we all agree to do one thing. Share. Let's share our wisdom, share our time, share our talents, share our finances. But most of all, let's share our love. This is The Female Solution. Join me, Naima Latif, every morning, 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. Central Standard Time, as we bring you stimulating discussions about the issues affecting our lives. If you're listening online at www.blogtalkradio.com forward slash the dash female dash solution, press the blue button that says follow and get our daily topics every morning directly to your email and your smartphone. Hi, I'm Naima Latif. Executive Producer of the Female Solution Radio Show. We invite you to call in 515-605-9325 and participate in this daily think tank as we examine the challenges we face and develop solutions that restore peace and harmony. We are global transformers, changing the world from the way it is to the way it should be. We are one. Wherever we live on this earth, We are one human family. On behalf of our team of radio hosts, I'd like to extend a greeting to all the members of our family, whenever and wherever you may be listening around the world. To our family in China, Ni Hao. In India, Namaste. In Japan, Konnichiwa. In Korea, Annyeonghaseyo. In Russia, Zrastutsye. In Germany, Guten Tag. In Poland, Dzień Dobry. In France, bonjour. In Spain, hola. In Italy, ciao. In Egypt, athen wasalan. In Ghana, akwaba. In Nigeria, peleo. In South Africa, saobona. In Senegal, nangadef. In Kenya, jambo. In Israel, shalom. In Pakistan, Afghanistan, and Saudi Arabia, assalamu alaikum. Greetings. And may peace be upon you all. Is Monday morning a struggle to get out of bed, into the swing of things? Well, don't worry, you are not alone. Join us for thought-provoking, stimulating, and mindful conversations on higher learning with Zelda Speaks for your Monday morning mindfulness session on Blog Talk Radio, The Female Solution, Mondays, 7.30 7.30 until 9 a.m. Be sure and send your ideas, thoughts, comments, and suggestions. Experience mindfulness moments with the mindfulness slash stress relief coach, Zelda Speaks. And thanks for sharing the mindfulness moment tip of the day. Stay on purpose, stay empowered, and stay tuned to your next session of mindfulness on higher learning with Zelda Speaks. Make it a mindful day. And thanks for listening. <laughs> And it's time for our Monday morning mindfulness meditation. That is, it's time for us to do some deep breathing this morning where we will connect with our higher power, our higher consciousness, whatever you choose to call it. Your breath is the force of life, and it, which connects you to your higher consciousness. And when you take the time to breathe, you will know a, you will feel a difference in your body immediately. That's why we do this, so that we, when we are confronted with issues on a daily basis, we have within us the power to disconnect from all the noise out there and focus on what's going on in here. And I tell people all the time, turn off the TV, turn off the radio, even turn off your phone, okay? Turn it off so that you can connect with that creator, which is responsible for your being here, so that you can hear them. You can't hear the still, small voice when you've got the TV and the radio and the phone on all the time. You've got to get some quiet time. It's called me time. And especially at home now, because people know you're home all day. It's like they call all damn day, texting and tweeting and, and stuff. It's like, no, this is my time. Ooh, uh, I sent you a text two hours ago. Uh, yeah, 
Uh, did it ever occur to you that I might be working on the Higher Learning Network TV show? I could be editing. Editing takes up a lot of time. I do not have the staff of Oprah Winfrey on the Oprah Winfrey Network. I have two editors and myself, and we edit 24-7. That's what we do. It takes a lot to run a show. So don't get mad at me because you can't reach me. Send me a text. I'll get back to you when I can. Anyway, I'm through vetting on that one. Anyway, uh, as we... Um, Close our eyes because you should not be looking at me. You should be looking at the inside of your eyelids. We'll sit up straight in our chairs, feet flat on the floor. Move those wrists. Move those ankles. Move those shoulders. Get us some little fluids going on up in here this morning. Did you stretch when you got out of bed this morning? I hope you stretch every morning before before you get out of bed. Let those muscles know like a cat. Stretch in the morning and say, ah, yeah. The body is waiting on you, and the mind is waiting for you to slow it down as we will breathe in. Hold it. And breathe out. And that's all we're going to do. We're just going to breathe. Nothing special. We're just going to breathe. Breathing changes the frequencies in your body. As one of the guests on the show, I think it's the energy guy named Dwayne, he told us about this on my YouTube channel, too. Go, go and see the energy guy. Two videos from him on Zelda Speaks YouTube channel. He talked about the reticular activity systems within the brain, telekinesis and telepathic communication. And that's what you're doing this morning. You're communicating with all the systems of the body and the brain and the cells and the muscles and the ligaments. So we're going to give them the direction in which to go in this morning because they're waiting on directions from us. So as we breathe in... Hold it, and as you breathe out, take a long, deep blowout. Breathe in. Hold it, and let it out long and slow. Feel that calming effect in your body already. The body is already responding as we breathe in. Hold it, and breathe out. You should not be looking at me. You should only be looking at the inside of your eyelids as we breathe in. Hold it, and breathe out, pushing it all the way out. And as we breathe in, Continue breathing on your own as I talk to you. Know that you are at the right place at the right time doing the right thing because someone somewhere cannot breathe on their own. And look at you breathing all on your own. No respirator, no CPAP machine, no asthma medicine, no nothing. Just simply breathing. Just As you breathe in and breathe out, giving thanks for the power of the breath. Breathing in the highest of vibrations of love and of light and of divine energy. As we breathe in, we give thanks for the love and the light and the eternal energy. And as we breathe out, we let go of faith, fear, and hate. It's called fate. (laughs) We let go of fear and hate. We let go of fear and hate. As we breathe in, hold it. And as we breathe out, we let go of fear and love. Of let go of fear and hate. As we breathe in, breathing in love, light, and energy. As we breathe in, for forgiveness, we forgive all those who may have harmed us, and we release them. Then once more, breathing in understanding, overstanding. Hold it. As we breathe out, we let go of doubt and indecisiveness. As we continue to breathe in, we can choose whatever words we like, but I like to choose the words I am. Two of the most powerful words on the planet. I am love. 
I am light. I am eternal energy. And as we breathe in, take one more long, deep breath, sending all of that energy to the top of the head as we breathe in. And as we breathe out, sending that energy down through the face, the forehead, the chin, and the shoulders as we breathe in. Move those shoulders as we breathe in. Sending more light and love and energy down through the chest and the sides and the back and the buttock as we breathe in. And as we breathe out, sending more light and love and energy down through the hips and the thighs and the knees. Yes, honey, rub those glorious knees. They keep us mobile. They keep us moving. Sending that energy on down through the legs and the ankles and the arches and the instep and the foot as we breathe in. Wiggle those toes, sending that energy back up through the legs and the knees and the hips and the back and the sides and the solar plexus, bringing that energy back up through our shoulders, chest, and our face, and back to the top of the head, and feel free to bring those arms up and wiggle them, and wiggle those wrists and the fingers and the toes and the shoulders, just wiggle everything, and take one more long, deep breath, inhale deeply. And as we exhale, bring the forehead down, chin to chest, and slowly rotate that head to the left. That's why you're sitting up straight, so you don't experience anything other than divine circulation as your head is slowly getting to the back and slowly coming around to the right, slowly, slowly, bringing the head back, center, head up, inhale deeply, hold it. And exhale, bringing the chin back down to chest, slowly rotating the head to the left, slowly, slow down, you're moving too fast, slowly moving that head back to the back, slowly bringing it around to the right, slowly, 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 oh, oh yes, head up, inhale deeply, let's do that again. Bring the head down, chin to chest. Rotate the head to the right. Oh, yes, that feels good. Slowly bringing it around to the back. Slow down. Oh, just feeling it in increments. Feeling the stretch in increments. Yes, bringing the head back around to the front. Head up. Inhale deeply. Once more, bringing the head back down, chin to chest. Slowly rotating the head to the left. Slowly rotating the head back around to the back. Slow down. And slowly bringing it around to the right. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Bringing the head back to the chest. Head up. Take another long, deep breath. Inhale deeply. Looking to the left as far as you possibly can. Bringing, uh, feeling the stretch in the right of the neck. And bringing the head back forward. Inhale deeply again. And exhale, bringing the head to the right as far as you possibly can. Ooh, I feel that stretch in my neck. Yes, feel that stretch in the left side of the neck. Oh, yes, 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 yes. And slowly bringing the head back around. One more time. Inhale deeply. And exhale. And as you go about your day, remember these are two of the most powerful words on the planet. I am. And what you choose to put after those words is entirely up to you. But I choose these two words as we breathe in. I am happy. I am healthy. I am whole and complete, just like I am. I am happy. I am healthy. I am whole and complete. Let's add one more to it. I am healthy. Love, L-O-V-E, because if there's nothing but love, there's nothing but love. And anything other than that is an appearance of a non-loving entity. And you simply breathe in, hold it, and breathe out. The shoulder's feeling good, wiggle those shoulders, good. Wiggle those shoulders and reach your hand in the back of your neck, massage the back of that neck, 
pinch the neck if you like, just massage it. Rub on that vagus nerve as you send in love and light and energy. Because, ladies and gentlemen, whether you realize it or not, you have just activated the happiness gene in your body. And you know what that means? If you send it love and light and energy, you're going to be happy all day. That is, as long as you breathe in and you breathe out. And you leave all the other nonsense, the TV, the radio, the phone calls, you block it out for your time. If it's that 10 minutes or if it's an hour, it's your turn and it's your time and you can have peace at any moment in your life when you decide to breathe in. And breathe out. How you feel? Good. You've just activated the happiness gene, and you're going to be smiling all day. I love it. I can see the smile on your face. So thank you so much for sharing that experience with me this morning. And be sure and go to my ZeldaSpeaks.com on YouTube. I'm sorry. YouTube channel, Zelda Speaks, and you'll see more information there. We've always got good things going on for you, so be sure and check that out. 